in September 2023, the G20 summit happened in India. In this summit, there was a special focus on green hydrogen. The new Delhi G20 leaders declaration adopted five high-level voluntary principles on hydrogen. These principles are helping us in the creation of unified roadmap. All of us must remember the decisions we make now will decide the life of our future generations. Friends, in such a crucial sector, it is important for domain experts to lead the way and work together. Particularly, I urge the global scientific community to come together to explore various aspects. Scientists and innovators can suggest changes in public policy to help the green hydrogen sector. There are also many questions that the scientific community can look into. Can we improve the efficiency of electrolyzers and other components in green hydrogen production? Can we explore the use of seawater? and municipal wastewater for production? How can we enable the use of green hydrogen in public transport, shipping, and inland waterways? Exploring such topics together will greatly help green energy transition across the world. I am confident that this conference will help the exchange of many ideas on such issues. Friends, Humanity has faced many challenges in the past. Each time we overcame adversities through solutions that were collective and innovative. In the same spirit of the collective and innovative action that will guide us towards the sustainable future, we can achieve anything when we are together. Let us have work to accelerate the development and deployment of green hydrogen. 